Okay, sorry I got cut off there, so. And ye shall eat the flesh of your sons and the flesh of your daughters. Ye shall eat, once again, chapter 26, verse 29 of Leviticus. Now we're reading from Atrahasis 2, and I want you to see. They served up a daughter for a meal and served up a son for food. Now let's notice the very next line, if that was not startling enough, what you just saw. Notice these are two depopulation events, one in Leviticus, one recorded here ancient Babylonian records. It just so happens to be the same technique and even the same order of events. You're going to find out there's even more connections. Let me show you. As we see here, we've got this part and then look what comes next. Only one or two households were left, meaning only very few were surviving that were left after this calamity. Well, what we want to find is that in Leviticus that takes place closely after this portion here in the correct order. Well, that's exactly what we're going to find. As you see here, the sons and daughters, the flesh is being eating of them. And then if we just were to move right on down the verses, what do we get? And upon them that are left alive of you. Do you believe that? And upon them that are left alive of you. And then we have here only one or two households were left alive of you. Okay. Let's look at something else. Let's go to verse 22. And this is going to be powerful. I will also send wild beasts among you which shall rob you of your children and destroy your cattle and make you few in number and your highways shall be desolate. All right, we wanna find a match for that in the same record and lo and behold, let there be the Pasitu demon among the people to snatch the baby from its mother's lap to rob the baby, this demon, this beast. Let there be the Pasutu demon among the people to snatch the baby from its mother's lap. I will send wild beasts among you which shall rob you of your children. Now, if I know, <laughs> I know that for some of you, <laughs> but friends, for those of you that have been here, you do understand. So if that's not enough, friends, you saw the vegetation, the match here with the daughters being served up, the few that were left. I mean, think about the Georgia Guidestones. What are the Georgia Guidestones saying? They're talking about depopulating the earth. What is Leviticus here saying in chapter 26? It's talking about depopulating the earth and upon them that are left alive. What is this talking about here? This Atrahasis epic, okay? What is this talking about? A depopulation event, but it's taken place in cyclic stages and I'm gonna show you these cycles. Well, I want you to see here, this whole thing is set to a seven time cycle. I've already showed you that seven times cycle, but what I have not yet showed you here is the real clincher. And that's that this is set to a seven cycle set for seven days and seven nights, discharged only the rhyme of famine for seven days and seven nights. This is a condensed and rearranged version of an older plan to depopulate the earth. 